Uh, so I've reloaded this uh, game. We're in the Palace of the Chosen. Um, see where are we? we are in the basement level of the uh, the wing that has that mage dude who's all powerful and kills me in like two shots. Uh, give me one second, because I'm still buttering up a matzo right now, and then I will actually play. But yeah, I'm not sure how we're going to handle this dude. Maybe I need to throw up barriers at the beginning of the fight. I know I haven't really been using spells, uh, including barriers. Maybe we could trust summoning death on him, summon uh, Thanatos or something. I could look through. I think I've found a couple of new cards since last I really looked at them. Maybe there's some new, like, hot combos we can use. I don't know. I'm a little bit tapped out for ideas. And this is all assuming that Corrigan doesn't kill Selena at some point during the battle. <laughs> I very much regret bringing them both in here. It hadn't really been a problem outside. It happened like once or twice and I was confused. I didn't realize that they're just a incompatible combination. Figured they would just have them actually refuse to work together rather than let you bring them together and then just screw you over at random times. Okay, let's play this. There, now I'm ready. Hmm. Uh, Cursor, where are you? So annoying. Any time that the mouse leaves the freaking window, it's a nightmare trying to get it working again. There we go. Uh, so this was dead end. Let's get out of here. Do not help monks. They are they are dirty liars. They can rot in that prison cell. The game has taught me to trust nothing. Uh, crap, we need to go open this lever. They are, they are Alex. Guy's sleeping in that room again. Let's just leave him be. He can he can nap. Well, oh no, we have a cat in here again. Two cats. I have to eat a potion before I go fight this dude. So we're all at full health. I'll need to eat a core rune as well. Save in here, here, yeah.
Save again. Stinky. We are very low on healing stuff. Am I out of core rooms? No, I have some stuff. I can get another. I have mana again. Let's not waste a potion. I don't know. Let's see, let's save again. Just see how much damage it does with barriers, and we can reload and worry about our health. No, we'll eat it. We'll eat you to bread. There, that'll have to tide us over. Ah, uh, I know you. Come to pay palm to Gunnar and the Emperor, have you? What are you? I am all powerful, girl. I and my brothers are sacred magi. Raised and sculpted to the fates of the savior, Doskius. Doskius is no savior, he's a destroyer. All powerful. So yeah, we're going to all use barriers as soon as we... Okay, okay, he's doing very little damage to us now. Doing. 
sure pisses him off. Whoa. I'm all powerful, girl. Look at my balls. Assuming since most of the other bosses have been kind of puzzly, this is just how we're supposed to defeat them. But... Again, I'm very thankful for those through these barriers. Morgan! Bitch. I've got no idea, actually, Titus. Are they? I've just been smacking these, uh, spheres. With now my like level one basic attacks. I'm not very good at using the cards. I don't believe in the heart of the cards. The last time I tried to fight this dude, he utterly wrecked me with like a one hit kill.
This the whole place has been like the definition of tediousness. Wait, he just leaves? Then kill him? Well, what the heck color key did you pick up? I was not paying attention. Red. Uh, we should heal, but I'm like almost out of healing. I guess I have roots. Red one was in the wing opposite this, I think. Oh, jeez. Good thing that they're all very deaf. This, uh, this first... Damn it. Can you guys, like, not respawn every time? I, I didn't save my game after killing that dude. <laughs> I also don't think I have enough, um, like, core energy stuff to do a lot of current stuff. I got two more core relics and... Or two, I have two core runes and I don't know how many relics. But I don't think many. Let's heal. I guess roots. Bam. There's still, I guess, two other boss dudes to fight. So we're going to want to um, maybe save some of that core energy for barriers and stuff. Fight the, the Thundercats over here. Because why not? I 
Maybe. Maybe we can get up here without fighting the Thundercats. I don't know. Nope. I know I'm running with them at kind of low health right now, but... Again, try and conserve uh, roots. Lena should probably use one though. Yeah, okay. We have not gone back and killed all of the uh, Thundercats at those rocks. I'm not sure if I'm strong enough yet. I think we've only killed maybe two of them. on shell three. Great. There's uh, some big robots in here. Please tell me this is the red one. Yes. What? <sighs> Are these the cloaking ones? I don't know. Whatever. At least Gorgon won't attack Selena if he's stunned. Uh, what? I have no idea. I don't know how far in the game anything is. with a, a level 3 attack maybe? Could've sworn that we did. Let's just let them all pick on Corrigan for now. the one that we attacked already earlier? Yeah, I need to keep better, better track of the attack. So this one's only been attacked with two level one attacks. take a two to kill it. Nice. And this one we have not attacked at all. I think Corgan can probably kill it with just one level three attack.
Uh, I didn't find any roots though. That's unfortunate. Let's walk in here and save. It does feel like I'm about at mid-game. I did like just get the airship that sort of unlocks travel to wherever I want to go. It's another oh, okay. Magi. I don't have to fight big robots. Awesome. We're all, I think, suitably healed. So, are all these guys going to be just exactly the same? Is he going to summon his uh, balls? does not summon bombs, it just slows us. Let's just see what happens if we attack him. How much damage does this do? Thirty-two, okay. Maya try casting um, a spell on See how much damage that does. Although we can't cast a whole lot on him just because um, we we are kind of low on energy already. Okay, so that's exactly the same damage as a fully charged attack. We might as well just um, snap him. I'm sure that one of the summons would be more effective, but I never have enough core energy for that. What the heck is with this? It's just slowing us. Oh, he does summon balls! Um, where, where did he go? What happens when we attack these? Okay, we actually do proper damage to them. I don't know how much health they have. This one took the most damage from Corrigan already. Probably at the lowest health. Oh, I don't even have enough energy to observe it. Let's see if it's almost dead. Okay, it was almost dead. Oh, thank you, Titus! City's rocks is now following. Is your username in reference to a specific Titus or Titus? Like, uh, you know, FF10 or something. Okay, spheres are dead. And now he's like weirdly standing to the side of us. <laughs> uh, I definitely prefer nine as well. Um, 
Though I didn't actually play through, I didn't finish 10 myself. I only got through like half of 10. I watched my brother play all of 10 though. Um, so I sort of feel like I got the experience still. And then 10-2 came out and I just sort of gave up on Final Fantasy. With all of the other boss fights in this so far being like sort of puzzly. Um... Oh no! I was not paying attention to her health. Crap. Let's save. Here, we'll use this and a. And she has no barrier now, so... He had, what, 83 damage with that attack? Uh, that was with a barrier. We probably need her to, um... Yeah, go ahead and use... use this. Yeah. That way we can get a barrier back up. Because if he's doing that much damage even with our barriers on... That's kind of uh, not great. What's law? When did we get law? I've got no idea what it does, so I'm not using it. I'll have to read it um, out of combat. saying um, with all of the other bosses sort of being like a puzzle battle, it's weird that this one we'd be just hitting him until he dies. So I'm sure I'm doing this wrong. Probably not supposed to slap him until he's dead. What's the point of these balls? No. Oh my god, that was close. So let's kill these balls like that. have like just a little bit more health. No! What the? Really? It can just heal itself for 140? What kind of garbage is that? No, 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 no. Why? Why again? Why? Okay, let's get them all to like hopefully very low health.
And then Corrigan, yeah, thanks. Oh, at least he missed. He deserved that. He needs to be over on that. Heal thyself. I guess maybe I could use a grenade or something. Are they close enough for a grenade to work? Yeah, nice. Okay, I think she can kill this now. And then Corgan will be able to kill the other one. And hopefully there'll be no more balls, respawning balls shenanigans. And I was on this side. Maybe we just do this like three times. Oh, or maybe next time they'll spawn like behind us or something. worse than everyone else's? He seems to do more damage to her than anyone else. to see what we do on the level 2 attack. Might make more sense to just use weaker attacks and hit him more frequently. I think when Tape's health gets below like 85, I'll start worrying about healing him. Very variable. Oh, great. Um, let's go for this one. Let's give him the old grenade treatment. Oh, why can't I grenade this one back here? Well, that's weird. Yeah, I can't attack the one in the back. Oops. Really? How are they still alive? Okay, we have to kill this one. No! What a joke. Whoa, what? Please no kill me. Okay, I wasn't that wasn't actually too bad at all.
so I can kill this one. Down to one again. Okay, so we are doing this wrong. We need to get multiple of them at low health at the same time. Got it. I, I understand that. This should not kill both of them. I don't know where the hell she was shooting. Let other people charge up their attack. That way, if Corgan does accidentally kill both of these at the same time, uh, I hope this one will be able to kill the remaining one. Wow, that is a hilariously weak attack. Oh, we have a barrier down. We need to get that back up. a barrier. Um, mm. Oh, we have actually a lot of core relics. I don't know why I've been hoarding them. Maya, put a barrier up, please. Yeah, on yourself. Oh, and we have to heal people. Crap. You eat a root. We'll just use a healing thing on on Maya. Okay, hopefully we can all stand at least a hit. <laughs> it's a good thing that we healed her. Should have to heal again though. Is the healing are the spells more effective with the more, um, like, energy bars I have charged? Let's see, if I heal with three of these, does that heal me for significantly more? Not really. You're healing yourself, I guess. I'll save the roots. We'll use up some of this core energy instead. Oh, I hate that. The zero attacks. It should just be a miss. Okay, that's fine. It's the best person you could have attacked. Really? Nice. Wait, did he not drop us a key? Oh, okay. Slow. Okay, 
Okay, let's um let's look at what these things do. So we have Law of Marduk, that's not descriptive. I have no idea what that does. Um I I understand what slip does. Marduk. Well, sure. Save, as always. What key did we get? We got a yellow key. I think there's a green one we need. I don't really remember a yellow one. No, there is a yellow one. There's a yellow one, there is the green one. And there's um there's one that's locked with like an unlit orb. It's just like cyan. But it's not glowing, so I don't I don't know if we need a, a key in the same way as, as we do for the others. But what sucks is we're gonna go out here and everyone will have respawned, so we have to fight big robots and assassins again. Of course, I'm just not not sneaky enough. Oh, this would actually be great for a core force, wouldn't it? Oh, that's glorious. And she's almost already charged. So let's just use her full attack. Zero. Awesome. Wow, we're sucking big. something, right? Yeah. Yes, I see, I see a Corrigan. I'll help you out. Eat this root. I think this will kill the big robot. Taking two, uh, two, I think, big core force hits on the core. So. How are we all doing for levels? 23. How is it that the one character who is always, literally always in the party has less, uh, less levels than the others? Oh, they all have the same amount of XP, though? Okay, I guess it really is just they level at different rates. Which is on the slow XP track. Like, Lapras. Robots are my worst enemies. I wish we actually had Grub or Let. Maybe instead of Selena. Please don't kill Selena. That's all I ask. <laughs> okay, uh, Maya will heal Selena. We need Corrigan and Selena to kill robots. Okay, 
barking, and I think one shot that if he hits. Well, of course he does. getting a little bit easier at the right now. That's just because we've leveled a few times. Uh, but it's still a real pain in the butt. Eat this. Because they, they do like a lot of damage with each hit and it attacks everyone. Um... So yeah, up here there's an intersection with one unlit, and what is the other one? Yellow. Okay, so green is the one at the very end. How do we open this one? It's locked. I have no knowledge of such things. So let's uh, enter this hallway and we'll see. Oh, it's probably yeah, infested with dang dirty robots. Uh, four of them, and they aren't even lined up in a nice way for anyone to get like. Their Your heat seeker. This will do like no damage on it, but we haven't tried it before though. Let's try it. Okay, that's actually not horrible. For one uh, AP, that's not horrible. I wonder if that's enough that we can kill them with level 2 attacks from a Oh god. No! No, 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 no. Do not kill Selena. Oh. Yeah, this might be risky. But let's do this. Okay, that was a little bit risky. Wow, we have six potions. I guess some uh, drops, some enemies drop them. I thought we only had uh, two. So I guess let's do another heat seeker. That was actually more effective than I thought it would be. Yeah, we're basically doing what they're doing. Don't miss. Corgan, please, no. What have you done? Are we gonna run out of these? Let's not use the. We won't reser. I'm sorry. She'll res on her own after the battle. We don't have enough spell salt to do a waste. Because remember, we can't resupply while we're in here. One route, that's where it goes. As punishment, I made Corrigan peel the root and feed it to her. Whoa! Okay. 
dodge them. Ooh. Well, this is a big place. Looks like we have more prison cells, probably. I'm not sure what all that's on the left is. Let's go check that out first. It is. They look like they're covered in roots. Yeah, we narrowly avoided that. A uh, Thundercat's not too bad. I'm looking for in here. This. So is that that same group that's walking in circles? Maybe. A little scout. Yeah. What are these weird energy holes with tubes going to like? Just like old looking barrels. Again, it's like such a weird juxtaposition of like high tech and low tech. Okay, there's a is there a lever in this room? Yes. Whenever there's a weird hallway like this, there's a lever at the end. So I saw a cloaky boy. He's all by himself, sweet. Maybe we can kill him before he cloaks. Yeah, I'm just going to... Even though these aren't fully charged... Can't risk it. Okay, with that with no damage taken. All these doors. It's gonna be like a lever door puzzle. Yeah, okay, I see another windy hallway right across from this one. Let's check it out. Not thrilled if I have to remember like which levers open which doors so that we can go swap them around and kind of annoying. Well, hello, sir. Can't see me here. Yep, thank you. Aww. I thought I was going to get away with that. That's fine, there's a regular dudes. <laughs> I forgot that they run away. Okay, that's fun. He's got to be almost dead. Maybe we should just be fighting everything in here, um, because they don't seem all that tough. It's like Thundercats and regular dudes. That way we can just get some, some loot. Alright, 
A lot of dead bodies here. What are you? Who are you? What? They just calmly walk away? Okay, I don't have any idea what that was about. Are those emperor people? Well, whatever. A red star. Let's not leave her. We'll look at it when we're safe from this robot. A red star. Protects partially from... Wow, that sounds horrible. Now where'd those guys go? Let's, let's just fight some people and get some XP, get some hopefully more roots without taking so much damage that it negates them. Hey! Are the cats in the same way that guy moves quick. I think the cats are more dangerous. Let's kill them. I'm totally up for some easy battles here. That is very refreshing. Well, it's not a little green robot. Oh, uh, you know what? Sure. Of Selena, kill the cat. I think the two of you guys can kill this this man. Just like a regular dude walking the Thundercat, and we ambush them and kill them. Whoa. Oh, hey, why am I running? <laughs> you should have ran away too, buddy. Levels, that's always good to see. I think that's everyone in this big room dead. I want to know what's up with those two people who just casually walked by us without saying a word. Let's see, in this middle area, that's where those doors were. So let's let's see. There's probably a lever on this side as well.
they even get to attack? I don't think that they did. Okay, so beware monks in the prison cells. Oh. Okay, no, there are they're not prison cells. They are like stable stalls for Thundercats. That's cool. Okay, I just if you line them up like this, I just can't help myself. They might be able to do enough damage to kill Maya. wasn't any quicker than if we had just let Selena's uh, gauge fill up and done like a normal attack, but okay, so we need to check oh, okay checking for loot Don't usually remember to hover over every little barrel. What? There are two in there. I think I need to run back to that other room and uh, hover over all these dead uh, blue guys. Just make sure I'm not missing out on that stuff. What's this? Is this a switch? Oh, it is. Okay, let's save. And a giant robo. Do I have caps lock on? I think I did. That's fine. I didn't actually save, did I? We can do this. It's just one thing. So we still need to figure out how to open that central door. That's maybe this big hallway down below me. Oh. 
Let's fight the kid. some healing. Uh, we won't use roots though. We will exclusively use all of our core energy. Yeah, it makes perfect sense. Here, eat this. We're actually finally getting enough um, like core energy and restoratives that I probably should be using it a lot more. I won't need to buy 40 breads every time I go into town. I probably still will. It is still more healing. Wait, so they, they can just jump over their fences? What's the freaking point? Oh, but the bread is still more um, hit points per gold coin or whatever currency. Charge. He knows charge now. Okay. Charge up power for next attack. Okay, for 10 core energy. That's that's the problem with some of these like special abilities. Like core force? Okay, that makes sense. It's telling me that it attacks all targets in line, so I'll use it when that makes sense. Like, Tremor, attack one target by shaking the ground. Like, what is the point of this? Does this do... I'm assuming it must do more damage than Double Strike, because it uses 10 core energy. But, does it do more damage than... Like, is it an elemental attack? Like, is it like a Geo Strike, like an Earth thing? Which also looks like it uses... Nine energy? Like when... It does not give me enough information to decide when I should be using these some of these special abilities. Like, like why would I not just triple strike every time? Or if I only have two energies, is Tremor actually worthwhile? Would it be better off me just using those to cast Geo Strike? I don't... Like, Kiss of Death. Okay, that's a powerful attack. Again, I'm assuming it does more than Sword Hit. Because it uses 10 core energy in addition to two action bars, but... Ow. It just doesn't... Like, I want, I want, like, a numeric... Like, does X percent more damage, or something like that. Like, give me some more information. That's mainly the reason I'm just sitting around using mostly just basic attacks. The game just does not, in my opinion, give enough information to actually like know when I should be using those other things. I guess we need to sit around like... Uh, maybe not here, but somewhere where there's like absolutely no stakes, like a random encounter somewhere. Um, like, do some real testing where we see, like, uh, what does, how much damage does a double strike do, and a triple strike, and a kiss of death against the same target. And we compare that with, like, okay, for that 10 core energy, uh, you know, it does this much more damage, and 
our spells do this much more damage, and I don't know. I feel like the spells don't generally do more damage than our fully charged attacks. Which just leaves me, like, very much not knowing when to use them. I'm assuming they're things that have, like, elemental weaknesses, and that's when they really, like, shine. But I don't, like... Unless it's literally an elemental of some sort, or, like, a fire mage, or something that's clear what element might be the one to use against them. Like, are these random assassin dudes weak to an element? I've got no idea. Am I going to sit around, like, waste four turns attacking with, like, different spells to try and test? Not really. So. I don't know. It just feels... feels weird. I would like a little bit more information so I can make informed decisions without having to do, like, extensive testing against every enemy type I find. Again, who are these guys that just walk away? Why don't they help? Oh my god, what? Okay, um... Potion, maybe. Well, it feels like a little bit of a waste. No potion, either. Oh, these are all cloaky boys, too. Not happy. The Heatseeker missiles still hit them. That, I wonder. Okay, let's, let's see. For again! Why do you gotta be like that? It's all targets. Uh, so it's like eight core energy, but for one, I guess one dude is stupid. Okay, it still misses. So now we know that is pointless. for him as soon as it decloats. Heal us, please. I can summon Kira? Do I can heal everyone? That much AP, I mean, it. Sure, better, right? That looks like it's. Three times the. Uh, did I call it AP? Three, three times the core energy. Let's see. Let's save. Save game. Okay, for 10 core energy, we can do a heal on one person. For 30 core energy, is this going to heal everyone? Or is this going to heal one person big? That didn't cast it. Okay, maybe it's like a combat only thing. Oh no, okay, I have a targeting reticule now. Uh, so yeah, what is this going to do? Okay, so that mega heals one person. Got it. Let's reload. <laughs> 30 energy on healing one person being super effective unless it's in like an utter emergency I 
I'll give everyone just a wee bit of some healing. Here. I used up a lot of core energy. Okay, this is all for just another item. Armor seal. Are these going to be something that we use? Adds to armor. Nope. Okay, so that was a little bit pointless. So those, those dudes that we rescue, it'd be great if they, you know, helped us out later on. Go back to that first room and hover my cursor over everything and just make sure we aren't missing some hot loot. And we'll go explore these uh, areas that we've opened the doors to. Yeah, I think there's a waste of time. Hey, the game like conditions me to want to just ignore all of the random barrels and stuff because I can basically never interact with them. So which way? Uh, so this looks symmetrical. We'll probably have to go into both. Maybe there's like two levers we have to pull to open this one, or maybe maybe there's like a double gate here. Maybe after this gate there's another. Okay. It looks like we are almost out of this room at the very least. It's a uh, area of the, the palace. There's just a little bit left. gonna be like one fight in each of these little corridors and then the, the last mage dude that big robot is my priority This is not the time!
Lever? Yes. Thank goodness. Oh, okay, there are two gates. Okay, let's go to the other side. It'll probably be the exact same battle there. Slowly run over. Oh, let's check our health and stuff. I guess we're looking fine. I might as well heal my again though. That way we can eat a core energy, a core relic. Where are these things? Little, little pods. Oh, two robots. Two robots, no Thundercats? Sure. Let's do it. <laughs> Here's a powerful attack. You too. You know what? Heat Seeker might actually kill this one now. Okay, that was pretty good. Have a little bug, just your normal uh, level 2 attack. We got another core relic. Let's heal up all the way before we go fight the mage. Again, assuming it is a mage in there. Heal up all the way, and then maybe we'll refill our core energy. Save the roots for emergency in combat healing. Are these more effective if I give them to Selena? I think that they actually are. Eat this. Safe game. Ready to rumble! Yeah, it's another one. of the Magi. Why we didn't kill them and they run away? Like, what? Let's do it, please. So, they're colored balls. The Magi are so colored. Do we just set them in order? The yellow, blue, red.
Oh, I didn't put up barriers. Do I need to? Yes, I do need to. Uh, hmm. Might be worthwhile reloading. I'm doing that first thing. Yeah, let's put up barriers. Please. Whose turn is it right now? Yeah, mine. I'm, I'm wasting so many, uh, so much of the action bar doing this, but I think that we need these. I might even additionally use a potion after this just to make sure we're all topped off again. Don't kill me. I thought you were close in here. Okay, that's better because that wastes less of the push. So, this is like the first one. Should we just be waiting for someone falls and attack the ghost? Okay, I think that we're doing something wrong, actually. Because that first time, like, we attacked the ball and it, the other one stayed. He didn't immediately attack us. Let's wait for some of the balls again. I think we just aren't understanding this puzzle. Or I'm not understanding this puzzle, I should say. It's all brightly lit, does that mean anything? Why can't I attack the red one? Oh, I can. Let's see if we attack red first. Yeah, that did big damage. Blue? Yellow. Does the order change every time? How am I supposed to know what order to attack them in? That was pretty cool. That did some big damage. Uh, so I'm assuming red is now no longer the correct one. Let's just see. Yeah. So it's just random. That's very weird. I do not understand the, uh, the puzzle here at all. Can we attack him directly? How much damage does that do? Oh, okay, that's pretty good. Why are we even bothering with the balls? Yellow. <laughs> oh. I have no idea what the word is supposed to be. Missed it. I'll try blue. Okay, blue was good. Um, red. Okay. 
Also barriers. That's Look at those way less damage from just attacking him outright. again, sir. Let's use another fire attacks. Maybe we should use water? Go for red. Nope. I'm just gonna ignore the balls. I did not understand the boss thing at all. So, green key, awesome. You got some root. Whoa. Um. Okay. Sure. Let him enter. I defeated you once, Doskius. I can do it again. Don't be so sure, Gunner. Do you not recognize my weapon? It can't be. <laughs> Sword. Gemma's blade. Sword. I have been doing a little archaeology. Gemma's blade. Forged in hellfires and used against Marduk himself. Now I know you to be a heretic. You claim to follow Marduk, but you do Gemma's work. Fool! I am the direct descendant of Marduk. I am the savior of Septera. I do not Gemma's bidding, but the Lord's. Did not Marduk turn Gemma's demons against him? Did he not trap them and call them for his own? As Marduk once did, I shall use the very forces of darkness to fight for light. You're mad! <laughs> <laughs> Nothing right. stands in my way now except the Emperor. But he will not stand for long. Uh, sure. Here to save him, right? We will eat one of these. We should probably save. Um, let's do that when we get into the next room, back into the first room. Now we save. So what, do we, do we fight Dossius next? I'm assuming not. I'm assuming he's like the final boss. Or maybe, maybe Gamma is. Maybe we need to fight Gamma ourselves. Doing heat seeker. Ouch, Maya's in uh, some danger. Yeah, I don't 
think we need to fully charge. Now mine can take one more hit. Yeah. Ooh, barely. This might be dumb. Well, Selena, yes, Selena, use a potion. But they've taken two heat seekers. So it's just to use level two attacks. Let's heal up. Try and stay maybe topped off here. Not topped off, but that's good enough. We'll stay above 150. Wait, so we do we just never go into here? It's locked. That's weird. The green key is up here. Okay, kitties. Five. You know what? Sure. Poor kid. because Corgan is horrible. Final, final encounter of this area. Father, the city is in ruins. We must escape. No, I must stay and confront Doskius with honor. Would he do the same for you? Take this and keep it safe. The Imperial Seal? It is proof of your bloodline. Yes, One it, day so you will use it to reclaim the throne from the heretic. I won't leave you here to die. Go! If we both die, our bloodline ends today. Go! Goodbye, Father. Did I just walk right by her? The heretic can't be bothered to kill me in person. He has to send his hell spawn. 
You will know soon enough that we are the spawn of hell. You ask Gero when you meet him in the pits of Janak. Oh, so we don't even get to like save him. Wow, just barely too late. What sort of garbage is that? The tomb of the powers of peace are near full. Brothers, add these little orbits to its coffers. Um. Nani? Okay, we need barriers. There's that. Yeah, I can get one up before I need to get some more core energy. Okay, maybe I came in here not very well prepared. <laughs> Don't kill Selena, please. Barrier up, someone else will feed your fruit. I have feed my fruit. Okay. I like it when we get lucky and they do. That does not do much damage. Oh, okay, but did he damage his buddy? Do they each damage one of the others when we attack them? We did almost just as much damage by attacking this dude. Oh! Okay. Welcome to attack this guy. This is a big damage, that's what happened. Just 
one left. Nice. Um, I'm feeling like we'll, we'll be able to resupply after this, right? This has got to be the last battle of this area. Oh no, we're probably going to double back and go through that area that, um... Doesn't need, like, a close Probably aren't done with this area. That angers me so much, Corrigan. We are on barriers up. Oh. <laughs> oh. Um. Crap. Maya, put a barrier on Corrigan. He must survive. Put a barrier on yourself. Oh, you can't. This is no good. We don't want to waste Gorgon's charge, though. Okay, now we need to focus on protecting Maya. No, Maya's dead now, too. Oh, this is so sad. Um, here. Really? Really? Okay, we screwed up here. Uh, you have to survive for you. What is this? I need to make sure I'm paying attention when the barrier is uh, fire. Resurrect something with. Okay, okay, that's not horrible. Barrier. Okay, at the cost of some core energy, if we- No! He kills my ass. Okay, let's try that again. <laughs> uh, or we even don't have enough um, energy for a barrier now. No, we don't. Okay, we just have to heal up, normally. And Maya will have to cast her own barrier. We've wasted so much time not attacking this dude. I'm, I'm mildly pissed. There, there, thank goodness. Now please, we just need to attack him. Okay, so charging up was actually effective for um, Corrigan. Doesn't he do like 70 damage in that attack when he was charged? We could try 
try to summon. Okay, summon. Ouroboros. Humbaba. Summon Thanatos. Could try that on. That looks cool at least. That's a lot of. That is all a lot of AP. Not AP. Why do I keep saying AP for this? Uh, energy. Poor energy. So air and fire seem to use the most core energy. Does that mean they're the strongest? Let's see what Ouroboros does. Hydra. Well, it wasn't super effective, actually, but we did it. This must be one of the keys that Gunner spoke of. Did Gunner speak of keys? Duskies' forces keys. were trapped unless we jump. What? I can't let him have this key. Oh, it's the Emperor's corpse. <laughs> oh, lol. A core key. Oh, those keys. Okay, no, I, I know what you Oh, thank goodness. Let's please leave this place. Oh, so we got a quirky. Um, hmm. Guess we'll hang out here next. Let's go to South Farm and buy some stuff. I'm just gonna ignore those guys. Yep, better weapons yet. Can I interest you in anything? Maybe. Let's see. Strike blade. No thanks. What about you? Oh, you can't even use a strike blade. How much does this now? That lowers power by a lot. That's not worth it. Bulky shell. Okay, Light Shell has the same armor, but higher speed. Let's go with those. Ooh, that's expensive. Okay, we already all have wind shoes. Yeah, the three of us will go with that. But good speed. That works for me. About this general store. Let's get um, more potions or breads, whatever. Welcome. Look around. I would have had a cursor. There we go. Yeah, stock up on breads again just for cheap, efficient healing out of combat. I've got plenty of roots. We need more potions. Oh, 
Alright. Yeah, I think that that's fine for the three of us. So what else can we do here? Can we get into this reservoir yet? It's locked. All right, I guess not. I'm sure we still can't get in here. No. We can try and fight these Thundercats again. I found, yeah, four more pigeon. That was exciting. What is this? What's that in here that we can do? Just the beach that we can't cross. Yeah, okay. But yes, we can go our way back to what is this? Northern Forest. Wait, I've never been up here. Okay, let's go hang out in here. What is this place? Is this going to be too high level for us? Let's just see how strong these uh, bees are. Looks like we can't really go much of anywhere from here unless we can open up like a bridge or something. Not sure, let's fight the wolf. Yep. Yeah. Hopefully these ones are incredibly weak as well. Let's try level 2 attacks, let's see if those kill them. Oh, okay, that's sad. These are like, really low level. Where we would go. Oh, okay, there's a gate. Locked. Is that where you're about to say, Maya? It's locked. <sighs> okay. So I just made some sort of key. We'll come back. That's weird, though. If the things here were so weak and low level, why, um. 
should we have come here like way earlier? I don't think we could even come here before we got our airship. Back to Armstrong and fight that uh, big spooky dude. But he utterly wrecked us last time we tried. Okay, yeah, maybe there's nothing we can actually do in this shell right now. Let's just go down the list. It seemed like the robots here were incredibly powerful. What's this? Oh, this is like the big spire thing that the, the Chosen are up on top of. Yeah, do you have anything more to say to these? old man. There we go. Aziz, I tried to help the Chosen defend themselves from Daskias. What happened? We failed. Daskias now controls the Chosen Armada. But I escape with valuable knowledge. Gunners oh. told me that Daskias' artificial conjunction has upset the delicate balance of the core. Didn't Aziz tell us that before we even went up to the Chosen? Hell God. I saw a carving of a creature called the Hell God in a village on the lowest shell. Hmm. I know of a creature that was rumored to live in the interior of the core, in its lava-filled center. They can withstand the heat of lava? Well, if it's a god. What is Marduk's prophecy? After Marduk saved the world from Gemma and retrieved the keys to the core, he hid them. Marduk believed that we were not ready for the power they could unlock. He taught his followers that one day, when Septero was in danger, the keys would resurface, and that with them, we could gain the power of the gift and use it to save the world. Did he think Gemma would return? No, no, child. That kind of thing only happens in stories. No, I fear there are much worse evils that this world may one day have to contend with. Evils like greed, lust, and ignorance. What do you think the gift of the Creator is? It is said to be the kingdom of heaven itself. So it's ludicrous that De Gemma would return, and that only happens in stories. But getting the gift of heaven itself, that sounds perfectly rational. Uh, the Badlands, was there anything there besides wolves? We didn't really explore this place very well. It's not even worth fighting these guys for the XP. Give the skins to sell. I guess we can really easily just clear this whole zone and look around and make sure if there are any secrets. Any loops that we missed. So I know when we first came through, we were pretty cowardly. This is a stronger wolf. It might not die in a one hit. Oh, I definitely want it to hit. Make a few bucks on the skins.
not really. So yeah, that's pretty much it. But we have a factory up here. Ooh, this is spooky. I don't think we've been here before. It's the factory. The factory. This place has been here long before the Junkers. Nobody knows who lives inside. Oasis ships its scrap metal here. I wonder what they use it for. The design reminds me of the days of Marduk, only more advanced. The Chosen never give the lower levels a second glance, but this place seems familiar. Okay, that's interesting. The days of Marduk. There were also some like weird sewers on Shell 4, I think, that um, something to do with Marduk as well. Session. Over desert pipes. No, I don't think there's anything there. Go back to the Outlaw Canyon. Now, we went to Grub's workshop right before we went to Shell 1. We haven't been to this town in a while. Nothing on him. Looks like I'm milking it. You have anything to say, dude? Welcome to Galvin. Yeah, don't stay too long, you hear? Here. Are you again? What? <laughs> Where are we? Golden. Why so bitter, young one? Young? Yeah, I like you, kid. Here, share some of my grub. Oh, sweet. You are beneath me. Oh. <laughs> uh. <laughs> Freaking Selena. Get your drinks at the bar. Will it be? I've lost my cursor again. There we go. Nice place you got here. Sometimes it is just better to say nothing. You get a lot of business from Outlaw Canyon. Yeah, Duke and his boys keep me afloat. To sleep. Maybe we'll take like a quick peek back in that log canyon. Did we win Outlaw Canyon when we hitchhiked on Selena and Doskis' ship and got to Shell 3? It's probably also the super low-level bandit stuff, so... Can we kill these in one hit? Oh my god, we can. This is the saddest thing. Commit a bandit genocide. Uh, so I see these guys sneaking in here. Can I just use my heat seekers? That, that probably is just not enough. Not like barely not enough. Oh. I 
Yeah, sure. We got a herb. Can't interact with these plants. There, so I probably shouldn't waste the core energy on them. And okay, there is a door here. It's locked. Is this a door? I have no knowledge of such things. <laughs> Doors? What are those? This is the secret entrance of a bounty hunter hideout. I hired several from here for the invasion of Wind City. Selena, how did you get in here? Oh, okay. We did your job. Now leave us alone. You'll get none of our loot. We don't want to fight. But I guess we are. Now these don't look like the same super weak dudes. We might actually need to charge up. Oh, maybe I'm kidding. Maybe they are super weak. Excuse me. Okay, yeah, they're still really weak. When were we supposed to come here? Is this the earliest that we've been able to... Well, I guess as soon as we had the airship, was that the earliest? What's this? Oh, the Armstrong seal. Wow, that's really tacky. Corky, Lenshard. Spell keys. Spell keys. What are those for? What are. S what cell are those cell keys to? Oh, those are the cell keys back for Connor's place, aren't they? Why do we still have those? Usually the keys disappear after we use them. So now what? Do we go all the way back to Armstrong? And try and kill that super undead dude? These guys not a uh, retreat. It's weird that those chosen guards know to retreat, but like these bandits don't. Seems like a waste of time. Oh, we have another pigeon. Okay, so that's a good thing about coming back to these places after, um, because the first time we were here, we didn't have the pigeon food. Was that it, though? Alright, whatever. I guess this is there where we saw those first three, uh, the three Madra the first time. You know what? I'm 
I use the game seeker. We'll recharge the crew and we'll go back on the airship, right? It's not really a waste. So yeah, I'm glad that we came back here. Maybe let's go back to the smelting area and see if those robots are still way too strong for us. Going. And if so, we'll just go to the next shell. Not the pumping station. Actually, let's first go back downtown and see if they have some better, um, like, blitzer engines or whatever for us. Good morning. Move along. Ah. Don't you recognize me? Citizen of Oasis. Female. Maya. Now get back to work. Who's your master? The mayor of Oasis. What? Grub built the workbots. That's Warbot. Do we need to Chosen bring Grub synthetics here? never threaten their masters. My master is the mayor. Move along, or you will be arrested. Sure. Maybe we'll bring Grub and Lead here. <laughs> Hello there. Would you care to buy anything? Hello there. They already have all of these. We can get a napalm and a grenade for Lobo. That actually is pretty cheap. And we get a homing for Runner. Um, hmm. we could get, f <laughs> we could go ahead and buy everyone weak blitzers for these. Taser and Venom. Wow, a taser is really expensive. Um, maybe we'll not get that just yet. But we can get a napalm for Lobo. We can get a grenade for Lobo. Yeah, we'll get a venom for that. Um, hmm. I don't think I want to spend all the money on getting weak blitzers for um for those four. Not yet. Let's do all of our other shopping for our three um, main party dudes. Is this where Uncle lives? No. Oh, yeah, I don't want to talk to these guys. Where do I want to go? Let's see, there's junk mail. Go find it. I would suck if they had better armor here than the armor that we just bought, but... Hello, take your time. Bin. Okay, so here they don't even sell the light shells that we're using. That's interesting. Boots can we get for our boot wearing friends? Armored hydraulics or hydraulics? 
I think I'd rather get them normal hydraulics. Yeah, we'll go ahead and get three of those for all of our robot foot people. We'll get two more wind shoes. Everyone will have decent shoes now. It's a thin robo. We'll get two thin robos. No, let's not. Let's not waste that money yet. Here. Oh yeah, there is a shop right here. Hello. Welcome. Look around. Uh, you know, we can get a steel wrench. Sure. We'll get a blades or grub. Okay, we'll at least, like, somewhat equip everyone else. Not, not very well, but better than nothing. Let's go ahead and give them all of our hand-me-downs and stuff. Yeah, I think, I think three of us are fine. Put grub and lead. Oh, and we'll go back in and talk to those robots. For a power vest, it's just plain better. Oh yeah, I like that you can see the buzz on blades on his on his staff. Oh, what does he want to use? Pretty good, actually. Maybe I need to give that to someone else. Is an iron belt buckle better than a metal buckle? We'll leave we'll leave him like that for now. Whoa, oops. That yeah, put on a power vest. Oh god, that wrench is way better. Hydraulics. Okay, nice. Grub is still faster though. That's fine. Go talk to those robots. Good morning. Move along. Ah. Master override sequence THX nice. one one three eight. Interfering with a warbot is a serious offense. Warbot. Move along, or you'll be put under arrest. Oh. These guys are built well, but they need to learn some manners. Okay, so I guess that doesn't work. Yeah, let's finish equipping everyone else. Uh, sure, let's get our robots in here. Um, hmm. 
off. Robo cover. Hydraulics. There. I think those were the last two. Yeah. Leads venom. Okay, it's like little little tubes. All right, so then we'll go and we'll sell everyone's old equipment. That's well, sure. I guess he doesn't use the venom. Hey, I made you sell some. Hello there. Would you care to buy anything? Let's see. Skins we don't need. Heavy sheaths we don't need. Shoes. Why do we have an extra napalm? Why did I buy that napalm? Oh, the napalm and grenade, they're for Lobo. Okay. We just didn't give them to because we're, we're dumb. Let's go do that. One less thing to worry about. There we go. Now we'll get to the smelting. Searching the junk heap and the smelting complex. See, this is where we picked up like a random part over here before. Like at the very beginning of the game. I think there's an area here we weren't able to go explore. No one may enter unless they are assigned to work duty. You better let me through, you tin can. Do not insult an officer of the People's Army. People's Army? <laughs> the People's Army. You're not a people and you ain't no army. Oh, okay then. You're not a people. Okay, they do big damage. Maybe we are not tough enough. Let's see. Let's see how much damage we do. If it's like 30, then we will, we will leave. Oh, yeah, that's pretty bad. I think we can win this encounter, but we should probably not continue forward. Oh, hey, hello, Ribsy. Sorry, I'm just very uh, focused on <laughs> the game right now. Did not see your uh, your message. Yeah, I'm uh, I'm having a blast playing this. Uh, there were a lot of things, are a lot of things I wish were more um, like apparent. Like, I still don't know what the wall cards are, and 
not everything. Not all the mechanics are like super obvious. But... I might just let them kill me right here so I can leave. I don't think I can. Oh, I can run away. Sometimes this is grayed out, and I don't know why. Kill one at least. We can probably kill this one. That's not going to be worth it to continue forward through here. We are we are still too weak. I have to take a little bit of see, see if there seem to be a bunch more robots. spells that are actually effective against these guys. I'm assuming... Hmm. I'm assuming Law of, Law of Marduk is something that we would want to cast on ourselves, not them. See if Bowman can do anything to this dude. Here we go, the spirit of Bowman. The answer no, that's really just a waste of energy. remember to maybe switch out one of these two. That's a lot of XP. Yeah, no, let's save. Just a million more robot fights here. What? There's nothing here. Oh no, there's something. There's a, a door? Where is that? What is this? Disrupt. Is that a card? No. Is something in here? Protects from Sonic. Oh. Great. We found a crappy earplug. Is that iron buckle better than a metal buckle? It is. Like Corrigan, more Corgany. Let's give her the metal buckle now. We lose a little bit of speed, but how does she need that speed?
Nah, hmm. we'll just leave it be. I like having it be fast. Are we going to fight these robots though now, again? This. This grappling hook might come in handy. I almost missed that. Is that a key item? It is. <laughs> okay then. I guess that's the point of coming here. Totally worth it. Let's go back to the airship real quick. Just to heal up. Yeah, this place will be a lot of robot fights. Let's come back and do this another day. Oh, unless we can do this with grub and um, lead, maybe. Yeah, I wonder how they're. How low level are they? Ooh, that's. That's not great. They're very low level. I guess I should be switching between different people so they'll level up. Let's see how their repair skills do. Avoid it, I don't want to fight. Because his uh, two years is one. Berserker? Lead goes berserk. Why would we want to intentionally do that? You know what? That is actually more effective. Than just uh, attacking. Really? He fled? I'm done with that. Cowardly robots. I used up a lot of our core energy, but I'm okay with that. Okay, we have a, a gold-footed robot. Let's see how hard these little robots hit. This does seem weaker than the big robots. Probably need my other heal.
kill with Brad. That way you just don't get one shot. Why did I just do a normal attack with crab? I'm such an idiot. <laughs> I keep doing that. I keep doing basic attacks with them instead of repairing. Nice. Well, if we're gonna get grub and lead some XP, this is seemingly a good way to do it. Yeah, let's heal up. Two little robots and a big robot. There's nothing else in this room though. Okay, no, no loot hidden or anything. Uh, don't mind me. <laughs> this might be more than we can, more than we can handle. <laughs> a grenade. Hopefully they're close enough for that to be effective. Well, it's not very effective, but... Okay, why are, why are the robots leaving? The robots and chosen guards are the only two enemies that have apparently like self preservation instincts. No! No, 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 no!
need to buy more smelling salts. that effective against robots. Yes. Yes is the answer. Charge up for one strike. Actually, how much energy does that use? It uses less than repair. Okay, a yeah, wind strike is where it's at. Probably going to heal itself now. Nope. Nice. Okay, we got a couple of roots. Still going to use breads for now. Maya. Okay. What's up with the pathfinding there? Let's see. Maya, what what are you doing? Go over here, please. For a freaking hell. runs away like before. Yes! Speak of the devil. That's 
So let's just use repair again. Not wind strike. Little robots, we use wind strike. Why is Maya the one leveling up? I don't get it. So Maya just leveled up. It says next XP is, you know, 24,000. Uh, meanwhile, at like more than 10 levels below, it's going to take more than that XP for lead to level up. Is she just like the slowest one ever to level up? Great. Now we're doing for health. Let's eat bread. Okay, so little robots. Many little robots. We're gonna have to fight them. There's no way I can sneak past them. I don't think. Okay, sure. That's a thing. We're gonna have to fight them on the way back, I'm sure, anyways. Just right, so like before, let's go for the red one and hope the yellow one just runs away. At the end of this, and there's uh, someone's not a robot at the end of here. We have to fight like the mayor. Their ass is kicked because Grub and Lead are too low level. This might be tough. I might have. To, I might have a cast barrier. overkill, but... but I'm scared. Hopefully the yellow one will run away again. We're using a lot of his core relics. It's kind of a shame. Let's just go for this red one. I need to stop uh, letting her level up to two action bars. Oh, a red one ran. Okay. Hey, this works out. Maybe one more grub repair and it's down, I think. What's over here? What are you doing about this grub? Could this be Mayor's computer? Could this be Mayor's computer? No option for Grub or anyone else to say anything? Could this be Mayor's computer? You're kidding. Um. Oh, did I waste all that time coming here? You're killing me. Game. Could this be Mayor's computer? Okay, we'll we'll come back. I guess another time. That was fun. Ah, 
That is so disappointing. We fought our way through here just for nothing. No! I should have just done a level 2 attack with my... resurrect people? I don't know, that's... What a nightmare. And we'll have him get buried uh, in a second, as soon as he can. Wow. This is the one encounter between us and walking out of here, so... Resurrect on a poo. Here. No. Come on, come on, I have to be able to cast barrier on her. Oh no, come on, dude. Okay. At least the attack throw. Up, actually use a potion. This is such a waste. Barrier. Well, I don't have enough for barrier. by coming here when we clearly aren't ready to be here. We'd be able to do some cool, like, a little bit early. Get a cool item, or... I don't know. Instead, we just came here and just wasted a ton of resources for really nothing. For some XP. We did get some more XP for Grub and Lead, but... But is it worth it? Probably not. After this is just a clear shot back to the exit. Can we 
run away? Split up again. Oh wow, that's not. that work? Why would I want to run away? Is it never lit up? Okay, we need one more repair. Oh, let's have Maya shoot it first. Yeah, okay, we'll need that repair. No! Oh my god, if we could have just got that repair off just a moment quick, we're going to have to use another core relic or something. That's his point. Maybe we do just run away from this if we can. Okay, I guess that we can. That's fine. Um, I'm a okay, okay with that. Let's get out of here. <laughs> Holy cow, let's never do that again. Until we, I guess, have to. Plus, we're done with this show. Go buy more um more potions or whatever. No, not here, that's the weapons. Oh, we're still looking for three more birds as well. Get her out of my store. I what? but she's on our oh. side now. She jumped sides once. She'll do it again. Oh, okay. Get her out of my store. Welcome. Look around. Yeah, I forgot they would probably hate her. Let's get five of these to make up for everything that we wasted. Yeah, that should be fine. Well, we have this Armstrong seal, so let's fight our way back to... Oh, we don't have to fight our way back to Armstrong through the graveyard anymore. Now we have the airship, we can just fly to Armstrong. Man, how nice is that? Whee! Uh, no, not giant robo. Um, the town of the damned. Okay, no more zombies rising up. Nope, never mind. Spoke too soon. So I want to test something here. I feed them bread. Okay, I can. That is good to know. It is the same sort of Final Fantasy rules. So maybe if I use a big healing item on this dude up here. We'll try and fight him normally first, but if he kills me, I'll try and use, like, a root on him. We have many roots, so... Okay, we'll save again. Hmm. Oh, 
Oh god, yeah, okay. Um Nope, nope, nope. Okay. I wonder how much health this guy has. Okay, we'll have we'll use one root and if that doesn't work, Selena we'll use the other. Come on. Twenty three XP, that's it. Does it know that we cheesed it a little bit? It's a monument of some kind. The seal of Armstrong is missing. This shrine protected the town from the curse of Drax. But the soldiers and bounty hunters have looted the seal from its proper place. Now the shrine can protect nothing. My people will never rest in peace. The soldiers looted the town. Dugan's bounty hunters took the seal that fits into this shrine. This seal once protected my people from the curse. With Selena's help, it is now returned. This place will be protected. A place where the dead can rest in peace. I hope that this is a first step toward Looks reconciling so our differences, Corgan. I misjudged you, Selena. I may not like you, but I'll respect your sword as it walks by my side from this day forward. Please tell me that means you want to town will flourish once again. Does that mean I can have them both in my party now? Without having to worry about sometimes Gorgon stabbing her in the back. So everyone here is dead. What's the point of protecting anything here? Just let Armstrong rot, I don't know. Should we go talk to Corgan's friends in there? No. No, uh, maybe we should. Let's go in through here instead of the graveyard, though. I feel like it's quicker. Wish these wolves would run away when we encounter them. Just a waste of time. I didn't even notice Corgan has 300 health now. Is that from the iron buckle? Just land my airship on the other side of this zone. You know, the, the graveyard side. Make a lot easier. Better if I gave Selena a broadsword. Except for witchy sword. It would be nice if her damage numbers were closer to Corgan's. It is, it is. We stopped Oskis' plan, hello, Layla. Claire. With Gunner's help, we destroyed the lens platforms. It would seem you are a valuable ally to the other Chosen now. If they are Doskius' worst foes, you would do well to cultivate their trust. Uh, the, the speaking portraits are a little bit wonky, and the combat is kind of tedious. But... I'm enjoying the story, the characters are fun, um, I love that it's fully voice acted for a game of, of this age, an RPG of this age, 
that's crazy. So definitely um, has a lot of positives. Dosky has created giant lenses and made an artificial conjunction, but with the help of a chosen lord named Gunner, we destroyed them. This chosen lord is your ally? He was. There's been civil war on the upper shell. Daskius now controls the Chosen. This explains why all their ships have left save one. We must act before they can return, but first we must find the last of the Holy Guard. I'll find them. It's time we struck back at Daskius. We have reports of one last group in the northern forest. The Chosen have locked off the forest gate to protect the power stations. Power stations? Uh-huh. The great wind turbines that power the city. I've got it no idea whether it was, but it, it seems like it the was. city's reservoir with a suitable craft. Here, take this key to the waterfront docks. Leave it to me. Like, um, I played through Anachronox, which came out, I think, around when this did. Um, maybe even after this did, and that didn't have full voice acting. So, I don't know. But yeah, it was very strange, uh, but welcome. I just was not expecting uh, a game this old to have full voice acting. Uh, some of it for like generic merchants and stuff. It is kind of lame hearing literally the same merchant voice for half the merchants, but but again, you know, it's what else could they do? And it is still super impressive. But there are moments where it's, you know, it shows they didn't have that many voice actors. Well, I guess models from Matter. A lot of the merchants look exactly the same. So the Chosen have closed off these gates. I don't think I was paying a lot of attention. Did she say what we need to do to open it? It's locked. Talk to the library dude. I hope that she didn't give me a hint on how that how I'm supposed to open that, and I just wasn't paying enough attention and missed it. I'll still yell about uh, Selena being here. Well, well. Back again, eh? How is the morale inside the city walls? The people don't know what to feel worse about. The situation they're in, or the fact that their own stupidity put them there. How we open that gate, sir? Back again? Do you know of Marduk? Wind City was founded <laughs> by his followers. Does anyone followers? in this setting not know of Marduk? Yes, for Marduk raised the seven winds of Septera, seven armies, one of each world shell, and led them against Gemma and his dark legions. Marduk slew the Dark One and captured his demon minions to be called only by Marduk's followers. Our holy guard of the Seven Winds carry on Marduk's teachings. What do you know of the state of the world? 
Our scholars believe that something is very wrong, but we do not want to upset the people. But if the world is in danger, shouldn't you do something? What can we do? Our army and our people have been whittled away to nothing. Thanks for the no, no help, dude. I was hoping they'd have a dialogue topic for the Northern Forest or something. There's still the reservoir, but we don't know how to open that. And there's this weird area over here that, um, I don't know what to do over here. Yeah. It's just an empty beach. But it looks like there's another section to it, so. I guess that's all we can do in this shell for now. Is there anything else here? Is this where there was like a weird forest up here? That guy seemed really strong when we tried fighting him before. But I'm looking at this, and I think originally when I looked at this map, I was just like, frick, that's huge, there's gonna be tons of fighting, let's leave. But actually, it looks like there's only this tiny, tiny area that we have access to, so. Maybe, maybe fighting a couple of these bugs won't be too bad. If we die, you know, we die, I'm not going to bother reloading. Or I'm not going to bother trying again. Jeez. Yeah, okay, that's too, too powerful. How much damage do you do to fully charged? I want to see that. <laughs> yeah, barely anything. So, okay, we don't go fight these bugs yet. Corgan might also die anyways with his solo health, but... Oh no, even with barriers up. Okay. Sure. Yeah, no bugs for me. We can look in the shops, I guess, see if they have anything new here to buy.
goods are sold in the Bounty Hunter District. I forget what's in the shipping one. Hello, take your time. Could get light shelves for um for those three. That's weird. Why is a power vest more expensive than a light shell? That makes no sense to me. But we'll get light shells for the three of them. Regular armor, but good speed. Light hydraulics. I guess regular hydraulics are good enough. So get some cloth sandals from our alien friend. Get him a leather skin. Right now he has the animal skin, so that's a lot more armor. Is the relic bone better? Let's see, we're using these shells. Good speed. I we should get him a relic bone. Yeah, you know sir. Sure. Alrighty. Might as well equip everyone. Hello. What do you sell? Healing herbs and medicine. More bread. Oh, no, I don't need more bread. Never mind. Hello, take your time. What do you sell? Terrarium. Keeps lens leaves alive? Well, I'm sure we'll need that. I have no idea what a lens leaf is, though. Terrarium now. Oh, Layla gave us the reservoir key. I'm an idiot. Okay. <laughs> sure. Well, that's fine. We want to go on a shopping trip first. So I think now we'll be able to get everyone better armor. Uh, no, we need some thin robo armors. We can get those back on shell two. And for now, let me look at the sword dealer. I 
And the other big expenditure that we'll have is buying everyone uh, who uses en like blitzers or whatever engines, better engines. Hello, take your time. Should we switch her to a broadsword? Ten more power for twenty less strike. Now we'll keep her striking. I don't know if that makes any sense. I don't know if that means that we should get Corgan the uh, the other one that's more more power less strike. I don't know. I think here's where the self engines. Be. Not here, I think it's the guy in the middle that does. Oh no, this guy sells engines too. The turbo blitzer. Yeah, I don't think we want any of those. Can I interest you in anything? Venom, what do I have? Oh yeah, tasers, that's really expensive. We do not have tasers right now. We got some cool knives though. Speed knife might be worthwhile. I mean, it's still a lot more striking power than he currently has, but. It would be nice if he was faster. We could just keep him slow and DPS focused. Yeah, let's get him a... Oh, jeez, I don't know. We'll get him a metal knife. It's significantly more striking power. At the cost of only two speed, so... Yeah, whatever. Okay. So let's say... They don't sell the good engines here, maybe. Are we getting these sewers yet? This symbol is from the ancient language of Marduk. Perhaps it is a clue to the whereabouts of his lost city, Babylon. Is this lost city going to be that um, factory <laughs> on Shell 2? Get out of here. Let's equip everyone with their new armors. We'll sell the old ones. And we'll go to that reservoir. Can't believe I didn't notice that she did give us that key. The, the thin, thin robos or whatever.
Whoa, okay, that is a huge visual upgrade. Nice. I don't really want him in my party, though. Back on shelf three. Let's just sell things real quick back at South Farm. A little bit sick of going back and forth from here, but... Can I interest you in anything? Could get a strike blade for Cord. Oh, actually, that's. That's 10 strike for 20 power. I feel like the other way around is more valuable. Uh, well, we want him powerful. We'll keep him with the broadsword. Honestly, we probably should get a broadsword for Selena, but... Oh yeah, I'm selling. Skins, animal skins. Nice. Let's open up that reservoir and see what, what we can do there. I don't know where I use the grappling hook. Save game. Oh, this is that beach. Same, uh, same map that has the big useless beach. Okay. The city's reservoir. I can see a forest on the other side of the lake. Daskius wanted our spring water for his ships. What's on the other side? The great northern forest. But you would need some sort of boat to get there. Daskius took an entire city, killing hundreds to get this water. Why is it so valuable to him? Our ships are organic. They need water to survive. Water, it's what ships crave. Um, hmm. Well, I think that we know where we can get something that'll work. Didn't we, um... Find something on Shell 7? No, no, I don't want to go to Dark Lake. I want to go... No, I want to go to the place beyond it. Uh, can I do that? Yeah, here. So here, didn't we specifically say that these um, Helgax things float? Can I pick this up? Is this a boat? Helgak bones. I wonder if this would float. Looks almost like a boat. This Helgak shell would make fine battleship armor. 
open it? How do we pick it up? Okay, maybe I need different party members. Uh, let's try and bring big, big dudes. We will bring our alien friend, maybe he'll know something, and we'll bring Runner. And if that doesn't work, we'll bring Grub and Lead. <laughs> bring two people who can't talk right now, but... He doesn't seem too happy about us being here. All right. I mean, clearly that's what we need, though, right? Okay, is there a key item that... Oh, a grappling hook, maybe. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and switch out to these two. Maybe we'll just grapple it and reel it in. Or do I need a rope? Do I need a rope to attach to the grappling hook? What do you guys have to say? I'm afraid I have no information about this. Boring. <laughs> wow. Release. Oh, okay. Grappling. Where'd that come from? I thought that was like it's a handheld. Pulled up to Lobo's ship. Sure. I guess that's a boat. Do I even combine it with? No. Well, awesome. Boat acquired. Let's get them out of my party. That would be this easy. We can use this to cross the lake. Our boat float away. I don't have it anymore. Ooh, okay, that's not cool. I guess we're stuck here until we find our way out. It's locked. Okay, we actually don't have that many places to go on this side. We're not playing. Okay, we probably need to go up where that guy was, but... Down here. No, a purple wasp. A multitude of different colored wasps. Maybe 
real smart. Pick up a course sphere. That's neat. Not all the weird jungle sounds. Um, I guess we don't have to fight this. Okay. Oh, that seems like a dead end. Maybe we should just fight them anyways. That's where we're supposed to be going. Hello. Okay, we haven't seen these robots yet. A green robot. Okay. That was really good armor. It's just a lever. Let's open that door. Nice.
Oh, I like that it pans right across that chest. In case you didn't see this chest. That's cool. Oh, let's not fight them. Yeah, we already saw there's a dude right here. I guess multiple dudes. It's that big hole. Very stealthy, apparently. Um, what's in here? Well, people. A person. Ow! Whoa, that's a lot of damage. And maybe I should be using barriers. Jeez. Yeah, ow, I'm taking big damage. Gotta leap forward, then leap back. Crap, I need to get her again already. No. Maya, you waste your turn healing her. Uh, what do you mean, combined cards? Like, I know some of them can be combined, like, uh, if I want to summon, like, a weird thing, I can summon weird things, but... I don't, like, no other combinations, right? Oh, get this out of there. But, um... Like, those drone things seem to combine. This is fire, and it doesn't have air selectable. The only thing I can seem to combine fire with is a uh, summon or barrier. So I want to do, like, a big fire summon, or I guess a fire barrier. There doesn't seem to be anything else I can combine it with.
wish there was like a, more of like a tutorial or something for that. Because even when it comes to like the summons, I don't really know what the summons going to do, so I mostly just don't use them. Like it doesn't even say like does this attack all the enemies or just one enemy or what. I want more information on like what things do, especially when they cost like a ton of core energy. Because I don't want to waste my core energy. That's most of why I'm not using like Tremor or uh, Death's Kiss either. I'm just not sure what benefit those have over the triple strike for the energy cost. There's nothing even in this room. It's just a fight. I guess we're going up towards that exit zone at the top. But I want to explore the lower left corner, I think. Seems weirdly out of the way. There's hopefully something there. There's another little, I don't know, closet type room over here. Nice. The fire prison. Yeah, those are the only two, like, sus-looking rooms down here, so let's go back up. Ooh. Jeez. Hehehehe. <laughs> Definitely, that is how it is. I, I jam for our um, Pathfinder group, and uh, that is very accurate. I mean, it, it does seem weird, though. Like, it's just it's a little square, walled-in area. It looks like a structure. But no, just, just a fight there and nothing else. No loot, no item, nothing to interact with. That's very, there's a lot of that on these maps. And it's always very frustrating. It's from like a game design standpoint, so it's just like, why did they put this here? Was there no purpose? Just to troll the player. Yeah, let's just go up. Like, like, what is the point of this little nubbin right here? Like, I can see on the map that it exists, and I can walk in it, but like, there, there is no, no purpose to it. Why does this even exist? mention that because this map viewer wasn't like intended as a user viewable map viewer originally it's just hideous uh, every map just looks like this like just a bunch of squiggles all over the place I 
like ideally I think if you had like a proper map system you probably wouldn't even show the outline of like secret rooms and stuff like that. Uh, but yeah, what the, where the heck am I going? So two different exit zones, exit grids. Looks like I can get to either of them. Let's just go up. But I'm very curious what's all the way to the left, the bottom left, because that corner is almost like disconnected from most of the rest of it. There's probably something something neat there, maybe. It's repetitive jungle noises. I don't know if if they're coming through because of the volume so low, um, are very grating. <laughs> this is the worst stuff where it's like you need a specific person or a specific something equipped or whatever and sometimes there isn't like a hint or whatever telling you that you need that so you just stumble on it like randomly when you happen to have a different party composition Must have just been using the same party composition, so there's probably maybe some stuff I've missed. But... Uh, that reminds me, I probably need to bring Lobo back to that Janam battleship. There's a computer there that um, I couldn't use when I was there. We're okay for health. Keep going north. Uh, sure, we'll go around this way, for no real reason. Avoid the puppers. Uh, maybe not avoid them? Oh, we did. Whew. Oh, finally, the guys we've been looking for. You're Coon, it's me, Corgan. Corgan, what is his we name? We all of our brothers dead. Who are you? Layla has sent us to oh, find that wasn't you. Bowman names. is dead, and she gathers her forces to assault the city. Layla, Hope still oh, lives. No, that is his name. You're when Coon? do we start? When she has found the remnants of the guard, of which you are the last. What are you doing here? We escaped the city during the invasion and hid here, only to find the Chosen had taken over the power stations as well. We wait until the right moment to strike at the cable that connects the stations to Wind City, rendering the Chosen without power. But how can we sever the cable? We need to focus a powerful beam at it, creating enough heat to destroy the cable. A powerful lens and light source should do it. After we accomplish this we'll mission, lens. we will return to Layla. We'll have a lens fragment, I guess. Lobo uses a beam of light in battle. Maybe <laughs> we can use that to sever the power cable in the forest. But where are we going to get a lens powerful enough to focus the energy? What did she say Lobo, Lobo uses a beam of light in battle. Maybe we can use that to sever the power cable in the forest. Do but have to where leave are we going and go get, get Lobo? A lens powerful enough to focus the energy. You're cool, Gabriel, you old dogs. <laughs> Layla will be pleased. Yeah. 
Greetings. Hilarious. Is this not the chosen witch? She's on our side now. And you trust her? She saved my life on several occasions. Is she? Okay, so we need to... Wait, we can't get back... Our little boat disappeared. Hey, you can't escape butt spot. Sorry. It's everywhere. Um... I don't even know how do how do we get back to somewhere where we could swap Lobo in. Because our little boat disappeared and it's not in our key items anymore. Just this lens shard might not be what we need. Is that not a good lens? Oh. Will this do the trick? Perhaps. But it will need to be refined into a proper lens. Oh, I have to go back to shelf seven to that dude who works with Corite, probably. I meant to do that. Oh, so let's say it. Sure, forest. We need to bring Lobo and we need to bring a lens. There's the cable. Sure. How do we... How do we get back to our party? Is that what this other exit zone is for? Can you get back to there? Sure. Fight this guy. That's a lot of them. I ain't res or four. Although it's just um the two green guys and the robot. my own grenades enough. Never like in the correct configuration for me to make good use of like my core force abilities. 
Well, that stinks. I should heal Maya. I'm aware of this. Ah, oh, come on. Let's roll the dice. Oh. Here. I think if we all three do level two attacks on him, we'll take it down. Oh, let's eat some bread. <laughs> oh, that freaking like Uma sound effect gets gets me every time I hear it. Uh huh. Of course you. I don't understand. Like, when do you ever have enough core energy that a core sphere makes sense? So I do want to look at that bottom left corner, but I'm just going to go to the exit grid over here first. Hang on, let's go under. More under. Okay, this guy's doing big damage, right? Uh, no. Not as much as I thought it was. Still big, but. Oh, why are you all just attacking her? Thank goodness, he could have killed Selena right there. No! <laughs> I had her slip. Okay. Oh well. She'll be back up when we're done with the fight. Just let her take a rest. She needs a breather. I literally had her selected, I was about to heal her. So frustrating. Let it get too close to the wire. She was fine, just taking a little nap.
Okay. So the question is, can I open that door from this side? Hope I can. There's going to be a lot of tabbing to the map. Oh, Go away. <laughs> no desire to fight you. Was there anything? Whoa. Epic fight. Oh, purple ones. Soaks up a lot of damage. Let's kiss of death. Here. I got lost with big smooch. Still not dead, jeez. Okay, at least there's loot. Not bad. Let's go down into this uh, bottom right corner. I'm probably actually get off soon. I have a four o'clock meeting with my family. That big robot. This is what we need. And all the way across the entire map. Okay, I saw that chest. Okay, and there's another switch right there at the gate. Cool. Look there. Robots. That's no good. Shake it, and then we kiss it.
<laughs> I was hoping I'd do more damage. Whoa, had that take down my barrier already. Oh, they can like dispel? Well, that's no good. Okay, so we're better off with Corrigan, I think, using that tremor. I wish I'd give Maya a sword. I want us all to be using swords. How did they see me? Like, that's so weird. You can be right next to someone and they don't see you, but I think they're like triggers on the floor as you step in them and they see you. Not a fan of the grenades. Curse strike. I don't know what curse does. Him never told me what curse does. Or bless. That's disappointing. Of course, again. Okay, 
escape Selena. Oh my god. <laughs> really, guys? get out of this forest. Okay, I can do that before I have to get off. Spent so much time getting here just to want to immediately leave. <sighs> oh, what a pain in the ass this looks like. Another little peninsula past that robot. Question is, is it worth fighting a little bit for? Oh, I guess we have a choice. Right. Oh no, this is where that lever is. We have to go here. Okay, we can actually leave now.
So we will resupply. We'll switch to Lobo. We'll make sure Lobo actually has decent equipment. Uh, we need to go to Shell 7 and refine that lens shard. I'm hoping that miner guy can do it. He says he works Corite. The lens is made out of Corite. Um, hmm. What else do we need to do? That's all I really know to do right now. Oh, we need to bring Lobo to the Genom uh, crash airship. That's what all that our to-do list is right now. Woo. Okay, we're all healed. Nice, let's save. Lobo Lens. Hopefully I will remember on Tuesday what the heck I'm supposed to be doing. Uh, while I'm gonna get off, I have to eat something and get ready to hang out with some family. Uh, so, peace out. Thanks for uh, chilling with me a bit, though. Later.